Kella Cage Mafia, it's your girl Saucy, back with another video. You can't even sit in peace, cause all of these niggas be on you. I'm just saying I can be, yeah, one that you call and you talk to, girl. I'll share my world with you If you gonna waste your time Then waste your time with me I mean honestly Open your eyes and see If you gonna waste your time you what you need Then waste your time with me You could have all Once you go black, you never go back. I got deported. In today's video, as you can see by the title, it's Uni Girl Diaries number two. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name's Saucy. And if you are not new here and you aren't subscribed yet, what are you doing? Like, come on. What are you doing? In these videos, of course, if you guys don't know, I'm gonna be bringing you guys on to my HBCU journey, my track journey, my, you know, medical field journey. We're doing it all together, okay? We're gonna get down to the nitty gritty. We're gonna get down to the personals. We're gonna get down to everything, okay? Not too personal, because we don't need y'all up in my business. But we will be getting personal, okay? Today is September 3rd, 9-11. That's crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. So it's 9-11 and I have a class today at 10-40. So I might be leaving at around, I'm gonna say 10 o'clock. I'm gonna show you guys the fit for today. I like it, I like it a lot, if I just say so myself. Y'all don't mind my beautiful big sister right here. Say good morning. Good morning. We don't say good morning, we say grandma. Cause why would you mourn today and be sad? Words and spells, stay with okay. uh. First of all, let's get into the hair. Not even my hair. But this is how it's looking. Hold on, let me show you guys real quick. Let's get into it. Uh, got small talk. I like cash talk. Lady Diamonds hitting. Turn the flash on. I'm like Wind Dixie. I get bags off. Baby got a pretty face. Slim waist. Ass off. I'm going to get my own sack. Bitch, I never had the bag. Let's get into the outfit details. It's a little ah uh ah, -uh, but I just love the colors. Um, even though it's all one color but <laughs> so i have this little cardigan that i put it on like this you know to give a little preppy look with this tennis dress it looks super cute and i look a little thick yana in it a little bit so you know it's always a plus and then i have my yeah you gotta get out you gotta go, I'm gonna get go. Out. and then i have my gucci tracks on which goes with the whole get together. These how they look, super cute, super cutesy, very cute. And then I have these Gucci socks on as well. I don't know if I wanted to change it a little bit because it's a little bit too pink, but at the end of the day, like, who gonna check me? Like, <laughs> anywho. It was Labor Day yesterday, so today is really my Monday, but it's a Tuesday. So this is the first fit of the week. I guess we're gonna have four days in this video. But without any further ado, let's get straight into it because we gotta hurry up and go. Oh yeah, did I did I show you guys the nails? Let me show you guys the nails. Did I show you guys the nails though? Like, look at the nails though. Like, <sighs> you can never go wrong with a Frenchie, ever, literally. And might I add that these are, don't tell nobody. These are push-ons, press-ons. These are press-ons, guys. Looking like this, looking like this, looking like this. The reason why I have press-ons is because they're cute as <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get back to you guys when I'm all finished. Well, I am finished, but when I'm, you know, on campus and I see y'all there, I see y'all there, bye. Hey y'all, so we are now at school. I got me a caramel latte. We're about to taste it right now. And you already know I got me a warm croissant. It's now 2.20. And so we got like, I say 
15 minutes to get into class because we don't gotta go to class until a little later, but we're gonna taste this. Ooh, this is with almond milk, y'all. Mm. Very good, very nice, very good, very nice. Mm. Mm. So we Gucci now. We Gucci. And this croissant is about to do me so good because I didn't eat this morning. Let me show y'all what I do with the croissant. So we got the croissant, right? We put some honey on top of the croissant. So it won't be no regular smegling. No regular smegling. It's not even open. Ugh. It's not even open. Now it looks a mess. I can't even show y'all. It's how you go. You just put the honey all on it. And then boom. Croissant. Wee wee. Uh, it's very chilly out here today. So I'm happy that I wore this little cardigan over my shoulders. Because it's so chilly. Like, it feels like... Halloween weather already and it's only September 3rd so I need to slow down a little bit just a little bit I hate that I be looking so tired the bags are crazy Right now it's just me. We can. What about if like you're teaching and like we gotta like, you know? Yeah. Oh. So I can record like voice recorded. Oh no, I wasn't gonna get anybody else. Okay, I'll put it up. We are now out of that class. That was a first seminar, biology, FYS, biology, whatever, the first seminar in biology. I couldn't record in there because she was saying that it was gonna be a distraction or whatever. I opted out of the book bundle, so I don't have any of my textbooks. So I gotta go to the student store and I have to go buy the books right now, the text, textbooks, because I'm all over the place, honey. So this is my first time being in a school store. It's cute. They got some cute stuff. Okay. Okay. Look, it's so cute in here. Girl, I will eat it up in this. Let's see what they price it. Oh, it's not bad. Everybody was acting like they was gonna charge something like they was designer. It's actually good for this. And then the quality is fire. Only 140 for that? That's good. I thought they was about to be like three. 300 for a sweater if they did that i would have been walking out right now look it's so cute okay i'm gonna be repping my school yeah just watch i'm trying to find the textbooks some cute stuff in here yeah look at it okay we didn't cover this hold on i'm going crazy on the fact that this is really a store like they got chargers cleaning supplies okay my hbcu doing it right oh not the hair supplies oh my gosh i love it okay this is what we do y'all <laughs> i mean this is my school or whatever excuse me where do i go to pick up a textbook oh all the way in the back like that way okay thank you hold on y'all Hey y'all, so we have a lot of time until next class and I'm just in Kristen's dorm because I'm really tired. Like I'm really tired. I was gonna go to the library and like finish up some work, but I looked and I have no work. So <laughs> your girl's free. I just came in here to like stretch my toes and things like that because it's not hot outside. It actually feels really good, but I just don't wanna be outside right now. So I'm about to chill in here. I'm gonna get back to you guys yes. and go to the next oh class. Hey guys, so it is now 1.28. I took a little nap because I really, really, really needed the nap, y'all. I really needed the nap. My next class is at two o'clock. We're not gonna be going to lab today, so that's gonna go by smooth because our lab is usually it's usually two hours and 30 minutes long like something like that so we've been in there for a while but we haven't been in there till next next week i think 
So I'm going to bring you guys along on the labs, y'all. I have, like, hands-on experience with surgery and stuff like that, thank God, in this lab. I expect to, you know, open things up. Like, probably a pig or a frog or something like that. I really want to do that. I want to, you know, sew it back together, take some lungs and parts and stuff out of here. You know what I mean? If that doesn't sound weird. But, y'all know, I like to open things up, figure things out inside. You know what I mean? So... I'm super excited for that. Hopefully we do that. And I also want to like dibble dabble in formulas and you know cartoon type junk where you like put it in and poof change it in different colors and stuff like that. I want to get into that. So hopefully we do a lot of good lab projects in the lab. And y'all know y'all not going to miss nothing at all. Y'all not going to miss it at all. So, so I'm getting ready to go to that class right now. I want to take some pictures today just because this outfit with this cardigan just looks so cute. Hopefully they're main worthy. I'll give it an A. I'll give it an A. But yeah, I'm the outfit. Taylor wants to say hi. She just came back from Virginia. Yeah. Yeah, how was it? It's okay. I was ready to come back here because I love my HBCU. Oh, girl. I'm so. glad you like it like that because I like it, y'all. I like it. It's but. fun. I think I was just getting tired of my appearance, y'all. They, oh, okay, they was yeah. getting a little annoying, so. I might take pictures today. I might not. I don't know. I'm going to get back to you guys when we go to class or either while I'm taking my pictures. Yeah. Okay, so I thought this class started at 2 o'clock. And I'm in Kristen's room just making TikToks. Like, it started at 2. Like, girl. It started at 1.40. Yeah. So we just rushed here a little bit. We good, though. Because it's not even 1. Oh, it's 1.40 now. So I'm not gonna, I'm gonna stop talking to y'all before he start talking. Look at all the people in the class. A whole bunch of people in here. So um, I'm gonna show you guys a little snippet of what we're doing. We're not doing labs, so it's not gonna be much that you guys wanna watch. We have it on Thursday, y'all, so I'm gonna put you guys on to that one. But we don't have lab today. So I don't know if y'all wanna watch that, or watch what we're doing, because we do a lot of talking. A whole bunch of talking. A whole bunch of talking. I'm gonna put you guys on. I left my iPad today, so I don't know how I'm gonna do my work. I'm gonna do my work on my phone. Also, have an issue. You can't even sit in peace. Cause all of these niggas be on you. I'm just saying I can be. That you call and you talk to, girl. I'll share my world with you. If you wanna waste your time, yeah. Have left from biology that was the last oh yeah all over my face hold on this my la this is our last class for today y'all i'm so done with it my camera is about to die and i don't have the battery with me so i think this is going to be it for today's video well not today's video today's segment and i'm gonna see you guys either when i get home or tomorrow morning let me close this door because my mom has a little bit of loud gospel music. Let me tell y'all, give y'all a little rundown. Hi everyone, good morning. It is literally the next day. Um, I didn't feel my classes yesterday only because I couldn't find my batteries. After I told you guys it was dying, I couldn't find any of my batteries. So I didn't have any time to charge you guys up because none of my batteries were found until this morning um, but that's another story for another day or can i tell you today no it really doesn't matter so let me tell you guys what happened yesterday so as you know i run track for my university and you know god is good so we wake up every morning at five o'clock 5 a.m well we really have to wake up at like 4 34 4 a.m but we have to be on the track or in the locker room at 5 a.m Yesterday, I don't know what happened, but I woke up at 5.40, okay? 
let me get a little closer so you guys could understand how much this meant to me and how irritated I was okay I woke up at 5 40 I was supposed to be there at 5 o'clock I woke up I didn't have an alarm but something told me which was God which you know he could he could have told me around like four to get up but it's okay thank you Lord so everything happens for a reason so no alarm I just woke up at 5 40 and you know I started taking a shower and hurrying up I took the fastest shower I have ever taken in like the history of the universe washed off the soap bow 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 dry it off I don't even know if I dried off I put my clothes on and I ordered my Uber. I got in and I got there on the track at 610. A lot of people might say, why did you even go if it was 610? Like, I wouldn't even have went. But honestly, y'all, I'm so passionate about running that I cannot let that happen again. Like, I really want to take this far and you guys are going to go on the journey with me. Like, I really want to take running far. Like, running is so serious to me. Like, I I feel the most closest to God while I'm running. Not not that I don't feel close to God in any other time, but when I'm running, bro, I I I'm pray like I promise you. And I'm gonna tell y'all about that story right now. First of all, I run there because it's so far. Like the campus is so huge. I had to run all the way there. So I'm like already tired. I'm like, bro, I already ran like a good lap around the track if it was straight. A good two laps, really. I get there and I don't know why, but I said, am I late? And he's like, what time is it? And I'm like, six. I didn't mean to say, am I late? What I meant to say was, is it too late? So he basically was like giving me the cold shoulder, like, mm -hmm. like I don't got nothing for you. But I told him, like, I commute to school. I'm not on campus this semester. I will be because every athlete has to be on campus, you know, and I'm a five-star athlete, <laughs> you know, D1. <laughs> Anyways. I told him I commute to school. Like I didn't just sleep in. I had to drive. I had to drive here. And not only that, but I didn't tell him that I Uber. And not only that, I had to wait for the Uber. Wait till that Uber. You know what I mean? He was like, okay, run two miles right now straight. That's eight laps, y'all. That's eight laps around. That's eight laps. I'm looking like, you serious right now? Because everybody had to run one lap and then go to the weight room. Say good morning. I'm just coming. Good morning. <laughs> So everybody had to run one mile. So he was like, you know what? You gonna work for it. You gonna work for it. Especially since you're late, you gonna work for it. So two miles around the track. Straight, don't stop, don't drink no water, don't breathe, don't do nothing. Say good morning, Pops. Good morning. Ah! So I'm like, okay, Ben. Mm -hmm. I said, is there water in the locker room? He said, yes, take your time, do whatever you need because you're not gonna stop. I'm not playing with you. That's basically what he said. Ah! I'm like, oh Lord. This, here we go, here we go. I call my mom, I let her know what's about to happen, and I asked for her to pray for me. And I'm literally serious, like I'm not, oh no, 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 no fat stuff, like no fat stuff, like I can't breathe type stuff. I'm literally asking her to pray for me, for me to be able to go through it all the way. Like let me pray for me, this is what's about to happen. I'm on pop. So I'm in there, I'm drinking my little water a little bit, because you know, mind you, I still ran there already, so I'm already tired, I'm already tired. So I'm like, okay. So I get out there and I'm just like, I'm finna just do it. I start, boom, first lap. First lap goes around, it's cool. Second lap goes around, cool. Third lap goes around, cool. But I get to start, I start. I start feeling the presence of God while I'm running. Like, y'all, if, if y'all think I'm lying, if y'all think I'm just talking, please skip this part. Like, I'm not even playing. Please skip this part. So third lap. I feel the presence of God. I literally start bawling my eyes out. Mind you, it's five o'clock in the morning, so it's dark. Nobody can really see what I'm doing, and nobody's like they all ended up going into the weight room because they finished their freaking four laps, so they could go work out. I'm just praying, crying, praising God while I'm running, bro. And I just like feel so good, like ooh, like bro, that feeling is worth more than a billion freaking gifts from the best person in the life. Fifth lap, I start getting more energy. I'm like, boom, fourth lap, more energy, boom. Sixth lap, I'm good, I'm still going strong, I'm still going strong. Seventh lap, I'm like, woo, child, I was gonna stop, boy, I was gonna stop, I was gonna stop, but let me tell y'all why, God is good. God was like, no, this part, I don't think it was God, but it could've been, 
But I was like, nah, I'm not gonna stop. I'm not gonna stop. So I keep going. On the seventh lap, I'm like 200 meters in, and I throw up. I throw up. And this is too much information to skip. I throw up right here, right? I keep jogging a little bit. And then I throw up again right here. So I get off the track just a little bit. You know, I didn't stop, y'all, but I had to just get off because I didn't want to throw up all on the track and have people mad at me. So I, I got off, you know, finished what I had to do. And I got back on and I finished my rest of my 400. He caught me right there. You know what he said? He was like, what did you just run? I said, two miles. He was like, that's eight laps, right? I said, yes, sir. He's gonna say, hold on. He's gonna say, do you not understand? You ran. You ran eight laps. I told you to jog eight laps. You ran eight laps. Y'all, I'm not even gonna tell you what else he said because it was like, you know, a my business. But just know, like, God is good. Mind you, nobody was out there. He hid and watched me that whole entire time. Me not knowing. God all up in my ear talking about, you better not stop. He was watching me this whole time. And then one of my lovely teammates, she was like, oh, trust me. When you don't think he's watching you, he is watching you. That was just crazy. He wants me to be a 400 runner because how good I ran it. But you know, I'm a one and two. Like, I'm not finna do all that running. <laughs> so he's trying to condition me to do all that. But that's a lot. That's a lot. But obviously, God is good, you feel me? God is good. If I gotta do it, I'm taking it straight to the Olympics. I was gonna take it straight to the Olympics anyways, but you know what I'm saying. Y'all come along with my track journey with me. This is gonna be bomb, okay? I'm not playing no game. This is gonna be bomb. This is gonna be, <laughs> this is something to see. This is something to see, and I'm saying it right now. This is September, I think, 5th, September 5th. This is, this is the beginning, not the end, new chapter. You're going crazy. I'm not playing. But today, we do have class, only one class today. It is a Thursday, September 5th, and later on, we're going to Cascade, you know, to start skating that day. You know, I've been trying to learn how to skate forever. I've been holding on for too long in this one scene. So that's what we about to do, get ready for class. But that's at 1.40. We We're about to go handle business as well, but we about to get dressed for class right now, ahora. And yeah, so let's do this little get ready with me montage. Today the outfit is a spider jacket, short skirt, bull socks with, I, for, I forgot what these are called. I'm thinking about taking the bow off. I don't know why it, it looks like it's like throwing it off a little bit. I'm about to take my Shilajit. This consists of like 85 plus minerals. I take like this much every morning. I'm gonna get back to you guys when I get to school because I have to take care of business and then 
at one o'clock is my first class. So let's go. Hey y'all. Okay, so I left you guys at the house sadly. Like I promise you, I did not remember. So I looked in my purse and I'm like, y'all are not in there. Oh my god. So guys, yes, sadly you guys are gonna miss a couple of the classes for today, but it's okay. I'm gonna make it up for you. I'm gonna mess make it up to you guys. Tonight we're gonna cascade. So I guess I'm gonna pull, throw that a little bit up into this video. So I hope you guys all enjoyed and yeah, you're gonna miss class today. It's okay. I'm gonna make it up. Yeah, later, bye. Hey y'all, so today is Friday and I only have one class. I've already been at school for practice at around like 4 5 o'clock ish until like 7. Now I'm getting ready because I have to go right back up at, to the school because I have a only one class, but it's online. But I have to do something after that. So I might as well go and I left my iPad at my friend's dorm. So I need to get up there anyway and then I'm gonna go to the library. I'm going to be in class at the library and then I gotta go do what I have to do. Yeah. And hopefully they let me come in and, you know, see and feel everything out because I'm a freshman, but I'm a sophomore. So it's just like, I don't know. I got this little cardigan on with my button up, with this button up with some ruffles at the end like this. And then I have this black little shortcut skirt a little bit with this little slit right here then i'm going to be wearing these and everybody know i love shoes that look like these honestly i am so tired like you wouldn't even know so literally yesterday i didn't have you guys so i couldn't bring you guys with me to you know show you guys everything and everything so what happened was i left you guys at home i forgot you guys and then I did all my schoolwork. I went to class and everything. Then we went to Cascade. We recreated the movie ATL basically, but I didn't see no cameras filming or anything, but it was still cool. Um, I guess we recreated it. But then afterwards, we left at 11. I got to the dorm at 12 and I went to sleep at like one, two-ish o'clock-ish, two-ish, two-ish. And I took a shower and slept at my friend's dorm. And then, at 4.30, I had to wake up, get ready for that, and then go to practice. Tell me why. I pulled my camera out to show you guys, and they take my phone. Like they my daddy or something. I'm like, whoa. You know, you know, here, you can take it, shoot. But afterwards, he kept me in there because of that. And I had to do extra smextra. I was so tired, y'all. So I came home after practice. And I literally went to sleep until literally 11. It's 11.42 now. Let me finish getting ready. And we're going to go to school. You know, it's only 11.42. No classes, but it's okay. I look good. Like, I really could take pictures today. Oh, I'm going to take pictures today. Should I take pictures today? Yeah? Hey y'all, I'm gonna get back to you guys when I order the Uber and start heading out. I love you. Hey guys, so I'm now at school and I'm super hungry. I came to this fish truck and there's nothing for me to eat. So I guess I'm gonna be hungry today. So this is what we got from the fish truck. Boom. Fried but shrimp it was and fries. We're gonna taste it right now. So this is he had the right book. But yeah. <laughs> I just broke that. Do you want some? No, no. Thank you very much. I don't like when people say no. When I, no when I. All the time. Literally. You sure? Yes. Are you sure, sure? They taste good. No, no. You gonna taste one? Nah. I'm filming, by the way. Yeah, you're me. And like, f what the comments gotta say. Literally. Just say what it's gonna go crazy. Niggas activated the Hulk in this bitch. He rocked this grip. I'm a grown man, bro. A grown man. Deuce, deuce. <laughs> He's trying to be in Ladera. Fair to say. Fair to say. Fair to say. We we gonna let the record reflect. We we gonna let the record reflect. We gonna let the record reflect. They thought they had one. F that. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? We gonna pray to God on that one though. My mom raised a boss. Your mom raised a. Yeah, no. But they have, um, like, cauliflower and other shit. They got cauliflower wings? I don't know. 
they have a lot of vegan options. Okay, I'm gonna go check it out. I forgot to tell y'all that all my classes got canceled. So today I was just free doing my own thing all day long. And now it is 8.36 and I'm about to go home and go to sleep. Because it's Friday, so I have a long... You know, I'm going to sleep all day long tomorrow, hopefully. And then... Sleep all day long tomorrow? We going to the game. Yeah, no, no, no. No, I'm saying until the game, I'm going to stay asleep. Y'all know, I'm going to still wake up at like 6, 7 o'clock. But I'm going to make myself go right back to sleep. And then I'm going to come back over here with the girls. And we're going to the game. I would show y'all Jayla's... Hold on, let's see. Jayla's trying to get on her vloggy vibe. This is her first one. Not gonna lie, it looked like she does this already. Not gonna lie. It's so cute, yeah. Yeah, we can just gonna get get into it. But yeah, I'm so tired that I don't even know, like. I ate multiple times, actually. Right after practice, me and the team went straight to the class and ate breakfast. And then I ate again, and then I ate again. Then I was like... <laughs> That's definitely getting edited. But yeah, so I'm going to get back to you guys um, tomorrow morning. Yeah, tomorrow morning. Bye. Um, you know... No, renowned and, and, and known for, for your talents and what you got going on in your gifts around the world, around the nation. That's having real motion, not just having, you know what I'm saying? Not just partying and shit, like, not just throwing parties and shit in the clubs. Blah, blah, blah. That's not having motion, bro. One thing you can never get back is opportunities that went once there for you, that you let slip through your fingers that, that you can never get back. Because one thing, bro, you never want to take an opportunity for granted to where you miss out on a blessing that could be for you. Because you wait to your time with shit that didn't matter, bro. And that's a and that's a great mistake, bro. I'm talking about time. You gonna you don't realize how valuable the, the opportunity is until you don't take it seriously. Like bro, all the other shit is always gonna be there. Partying is always gonna be there. It doesn't matter, bro. That shit is always gonna be there. Like kicking in with friends, they're always gonna be there. People are gonna want to kick with you more. Once you once you're you know what I'm saying, once you when you're grinding, when you're doing your thing, they're gonna right. value your your absence. They're gonna value who you become, they're gonna value who you are. But the and that they're your real friends, they're gonna be there to support you. So they're not gonna miss you because they're gonna be there with you all the time. Anyway, they're gonna be there to support you. Like I didn't know that you're trying to achieve something and and, and get something to happen. And that's and that's they're not your real friends anyways. And if they're, and if they're always partying and never studying, you don't want them in your life anyways. They're real friends, they're not gonna be Homework, class, studying, gym, track, training with coach, training with coach again, content on Saturdays, homework, and then class, eating. Like, bro, that's all you can be telling us you to be filled with that shit, bro. It's all like everything. I'm talking about, and be legitimate about the time that you, that you use for everything. It takes you, you got a lot of homework to do, you want to get a bunch of done. Okay, I have math to do, I have to, I have radio to do. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give myself an hour and 30 for both. Three hours of your time. Knock that shit out real quick, boom. You got your math done, you got your radio done. Go crazy with this shit, man. This shit is exciting. Actually, coach, okay, because you work with me on my form, I just want to download my form a little bit more. Because you work with me on this. Oh, it's something I want to improve on so I can actually be better. Because you work with me on this. Okay. Before you start doing that, like, you gotta, you gotta, Really get in that group. Get that shit in. Work hard. Grind. Take this shit serious, guy. I don't know the day. Work out every single day. Go get in your way. had a bad breakout a bad 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 a horrible breakout and they're just now healing up so like i've been putting on lip gloss and i should not have been but you know like i'm, I'm just a girl like i need to have lip gloss on especially if i'm in public and i've been at school like every freaking day all week so i've been needing to put on lip gloss but i need to stop so they can heal all the way but today is saturday september 7th and Today is our first home game at the school. So, you know, I had to come to at least one 
football game. So this is what we're wearing today. I have this Clark Atlanta shirt. We love our HBCU, the illustrious Clark Atlanta, with these pants that have like holes in them, but you can barely see, so I like it like that. And then, you know, making me look thick, like always. With these, what are these called? Oh, I also have some stockings under it that's super cute. And the only reason I have these on because I was about to wear a skirt, but then I never took it off after I took a shower and stuff like that. So I have these on. I forgot what they're called. I think I think old school or new, new school. One of those. But that's what we're wearing. Look, I, I, la, 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 la. I gotta go run to the store for my mom. And then I'm gonna get my Uber and I'm gonna go straight to school. And I'm gonna get back to you guys. So see y'all when we get on campus. Okay, so I'm here, guys, now. And look at everybody wearing their Clark. No, I'm not, yeah, I was just saying that. And I gotta so fix is, my lashes a little bit. We got some brown lashes, black oh. lashes. We got these, these, and these. Y'all already know, I think I look better without lashes, but I already have some on. So I'm gonna just make it look a little better. And then that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. Yeah, everybody having so much fun already, y'all, uh, outside. No, because I'm not in Virginia, so. All right, y'all. So I only have 12, 12, 11 yeah, minutes on here. And we have a fully packed day today. So yeah. I'm not going to let you guys watch me put my eyelashes on because, like, why you want to watch that? So yeah. I'm going to get back on the camera when we're doing something. Yeah. We're here at Ziggin. Ziggin. We're a little late, but we're going to see what it's talking about for sure. Go, Panthers, go! Y'all, it is so hot out here, but it's a vibe, I guess. We were talking about they should have did it like around 6, 7, 8 ish. No, no, 6, 7, 8. -ish. And then it would have felt like so good. But this game, I'm gonna try to see what I'm looking at. I'm gonna try to focus. Focus in, because, you know, I don't be knowing. Yeah, we moved a little closer, so y'all might can see a little better. Let's see what they do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, so me and Christian just got our face painted. Look how cute she did it. It looked like 3D and everything. <laughs> look at the, what? It's uh -huh. the, the Mark Smudge. Oh my oh God. God. She must have not told him nothing. All right, y'all, so we left that thing because it was so hot. I don't even know. It was like 95 degrees. I tried Wicked Wings here at, you know, the school. I got me some fries. I was gonna give me some cauliflower wings, but they don't have none today. And I got a slushy sweet tea, which is really good. Yeah, you gotta pay math, because you go to board. So they have everything. Hey guys. It's been a while. I got in here and started talking. Is there a thing on oh it says one minute. Oh chill. It's about to die? No. I only got one minute to record on this this. So yeah, I'm gonna get back to you guys once we're doing something else. <sighs> hey guys so me and the girls took a nap after the game and turns out clark atlanta won so it's two and no they won their first game they won their home game i'm not gonna lie they got some good players on this on this team this time because clark atlanta 
used to never win and now they win it back to back so i think i'm gonna finish this video right here i hope you guys all enjoyed this video remember to like comment and subscribe if you're not subscribed already what are you doing like get it together i hope you guys all enjoyed get ready for the next upload every single week subscribe 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 bye you know i'm so sick